Ho, 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 peeps. It is another month of Tuner Crate, and it is a Christmas edition. Um, I actually got this a few days before Christmas, but if you're watching this, uh, Merry Christmas to you if you're watching it on Christmas. Uh, anytime afterwards, um, this is kind of what we got. So, um, first off is this box. It looks really nice, but it is big. It is a lot bigger than your normal one, uh, which I'm kind of excited for. I'm kind of see what they're gonna do for the Christmas special type of thing. Um, hopefully it's some really good stuff. Otherwise, I'm gonna keep roasting tuna crate. So uh, let's just jump right into it. Okay, so first things first, uh, they're gonna start off with the poster of the, the month and it's gonna be Happy Holidays and it's gonna have the same uh, basically as the front of the box. So cool nonetheless, really dope infinity, but let's uh, move on. Okay, so next thing we got is a kind of a weird color, um, but it is a hoodie. This is limited edition, and then uh, has a tuna crate on the side of it, but this is what it is. Boom, so it's just like a normal little hoodie, and then you have a tuna crate on the side of it as well. Um, nothing on the back, um, but it feels nice and soft inside. It's on the little bit of the thinner side of things. Um, I'm not too much on the whole tan color. Um, it is kind of kind of on the weird side of things, but um, kudos. This is a really probably ex more like expensive, um, you know, items going to be in this box, but cool nonetheless. Okay, so our next apparel thing that we have is going to be a T-shirt, and um, it's going to say Tuna Crate on it, and then you have a little uh, basically USA on the side of the sleeve. Um, so very very simple. Um, you know, nothing, nothing really too much about it. Just another shirt. Oh, on the bottom it says tuna crate. So yeah, we have three things that basically say tuna crate on it. But cool, nonetheless. Okay, so I think I just found my favorite thing in the entire, um, in the entire care package. Um, I'm not gonna open this because I feel like it's gonna be a bit of a mess. But we have a GTR with a white Christmas tree on it. That, my friend, is awesome. That is really cool. It has like a little bit of powder snow on it and everything. Dude, this thing is sick. So I think maybe for next Christmas, I'll, I'll put this up on maybe a display or something, but this is cool. So kudos to Tuner Crate. Now there are some times where I question why we put things in this box that I spent $50 on. So, um, yo, don't get me wrong, it's cool, but some Pringles. Who, who thought this was cool? Cool, got some chips for a box I spent 50 bucks on. So we have some stickers, so um, you know, let's get through this. Boom, we have the infinity. This is actually really nice looking, cool. Then we have a Christmas tree. We got the Tuner Crate logo that was on the shirt, the gray shirt. We have a coilover, which is actually, this is pretty cool. So kudos whoever designed this. Christmas Tuner Crate slap sticker. Then we have a Corvette Infinity and an R8 uh, slap sticker. So this is actually really cool as well. All right, so next thing we have is a little uh, 3D printed um, little uh, ornament. And I believe that's like with the JDM um, ornament thingies. I really don't know what it is. I don't know if it's supposed to go like this or not, but I have an air freshener that looks like this. So that's what um, I think it is. But if you guys know what it is, please comment down below. But um, this is kind of cool, a little neat idea, awesome. Then we have another, uh, you know, smelly stuff. So let's go open this up and see what we all got in here. So we have another Tuna Crate Autocon that we have. Uh, we got, I think, one, this one last month or the month before, but cool nonetheless. I'm sure that it smells great. And we have a B is for Build one. So if you guys didn't know, I think it was sometime last year we had a B is for Build uh, Tuna Crate. Um, so this one's gonna be his Lotus Evora on the back. So we got another one of these, which is super cool. This one was awesome. It smelled really good. And then we have a Ferrari. I believe this is a 458. Super dope looking. Awesome. The quality looks really nice. The picture looks really vivid on there. Um, but awesome. So last but not least, we have a Fast and Furious Dom Toretto. Um, and he's carrying a Christmas tree. This is cool. I didn't even know they made these. Like if you can look right into that, he has like white powder stuff all over him. That is really dope. Like I really don't care about the little whole pop things. Um, I'm not really you know into it, but this is sick. And you can get Dom, you can get Brian, and you can get Luke Hobbs as well. So this is like a Christmas edition and this is, this is awesome. So um, this is the type of stuff I like to see. 
All right, so I hope you guys all enjoyed this Christmas edition. That was it. Um, the hoodie was probably the biggest thing that what reason why they needed that box that big. I was hoping it'd be a little bit more um, interesting. Um, I still don't understand why I have Pringles that came in the box. But, you know, nonetheless, I paid for it. Um, my favorite thing is probably the GTR and then the Dominic uh, Toretto thing. This thing is sick. And then we have all the air fresheners. So I hope you guys all have a good uh, rest of your Christmas or if you're watching this afterwards, hope you guys have a good rest of your year. Hope you guys had a good year overall. Um, I'm not gonna sure if I'm gonna continue doing tuner crate. I think I might move to petrol box in the beginning of January. So, um, you know, stay tuned for all those boxes for the next. And then um, I'm probably gonna do an overall review um, probably in the next you know, month or so about tuner crate and how I felt about it. Um, so hope you guys all enjoy the rest of your day. My name is Wes. I'm out. Deuces.